Hello. I am wondering which guns you bring on your boat when you go fishing? I'm sorry. I do not bring guns on my boat. Why should I? Are you stupid or something? No. Why do you ask? You honestly go fishing off of the American coastline without a full arsenal at your disposal? Yes. The last time I checked America is a fairly safe place and I do not see the need to bring dangerous firearms on family fishing trips. You must be a liberal Yankee or something. You are fucking stupid if you do not bring guns on your boat every time you go out. I am glad to see that you are so open-minded. If you don't mind me asking what do you bring on your boat with you? It depends on where I am fishing. If I am fishing from the beach I generally bring two, 50 caliber desert eagles and shoulder holsters. Then I have two, 38 specials concealed in my ankle holsters. Finally, my primary weapon is a 50 caliber Barrett rifle that can hit targets over one mile away. This is essential because it is a well-known fact that any boat that approaches one mile of the beach heading in my direction on plane must be a pirate boat that intends to rob, rape, and kill me. With my rifle at my side I am able to deter any and all would-be attackers. Are you sure that those boats are not just out cruising and happen to want to stay within sight of the beach? Absolutely. That is the dumbest fucking question I have ever heard. It is well known fact that pirates buy or steal yellow fins and invincibles in order to blend in and appear to be fishermen but I am wise to their ways. There is even one invincible that was built without stringers because the owner believed that by losing 7 pounds of weight in the hull he would be able to outrun my bullets. He thought wrong. Team Rockstar should now be called Team Dropped Like a Rock from Afar. Apparently nobody told him that the only boat capable of outrunning a 50 caliber bullet is a bayliner with quad force motors. I see. You really think this is necessary? I think you may be paranoid. I am not paranoid. I am realistic and you are a GD liberal pacifist. Have you ever been fishing public numbers three miles from land and had a pirate boat attempt to move in on you? Um, well. I didn't think so. Let me tell you. That is when the fully automatic assault rifle comes out. Due to the ocean of the motion it is impossible to line up an accurate shot so it is easier to spray and pray and kill the pirate captain and all of his crew before they get close. Then I watch as the driverless boat runs into my perimeter of partially submerged mines. You lay out mines around public fishing numbers. Do you not realize that public numbers are widely published and that you may be killing innocent fishermen and their families who are trying to share your spot? Again, what is it with you and stupid questions? I bet you don't even sleep with a tactical shotgun under your pillow or keep a grenade in the cup holder while you drive. Please at least tell me that all of the entryways to your house are rigged with C4. I am beginning to wonder if you should seek treatment. Perhaps you may have forgotten, but we live in America which is a fairly safe place. I really do not think that there is a need to carry firearms onto a boat with you because pirates only exist in Somalia. Spoken like someone who has never had to fire a rocket-propelled grenade at a boat full of dancing drunk co-eds who were being used as decoys to disguise the fact that the entire engine room was probably rigged with explosives and the captain was a Somalian Arab who wanted nothing more than to attack my family and rob us. Okay. I like to think that there is still some good in the world and believe that I am relatively safe while out on my boat. In addition, that's what law enforcement agencies are for. Gluck. All the Coast Guard is good for is safety stops. Okay if you say so. I really really hope you don't blow yourself up one of these days and accidentally remove yourself from the gene pool. I really hope you get robbed, raped, and murdered by pirates in the middle of the intercoastal and see what I mean. That is incredibly unlikely. Think what you want. Bye.